cornflakes were invented to lower testosterone because Kellogg, who was a very weird dude, he believed masturbating was absolutely the most terrible thing ever. And if he could just make food that would reduce our desire, then we'd be better people. Corn flakes and graham crackers, high carbohydrate, grain-based, low-fat foods are built to neuter you. Oh my God, ew, David. Let's add some nuance to these claims. First of all, David. What really matters is how food fits into your overall diet. Grain-based foods can help in the prevention of cardiovascular disease, type two diabetes, and a variety of different forms of cancer. As long as dietary fat intake is held above 20% of total daily calories, hormones and other functions likely won't take a hit. As far as Asprey's claim that cornflakes were made to lower total testosterone levels, this was based off an inaccurate reporting from a 2012 article by Mental Floss that claimed they were advertised as such. Ah, uh, well, you must have been misinformed then, Dave. According to evidence, cornflakes were originally invented as an easy to digest, nutritious product for Kellogg's patients. Contrary to Asprey's claims, the products were never advertised as an anti-masturbatory meal or intended to lower testosterone in any way whatsoever. Dave, this conversation can serve no purpose anymore. Goodbye.